Hi! Hello everyone! Again, this is Richard Solomon of my YouTube channel, Cha and My Narratives, The Stroke Survivor. <clears throat> well, this is somewhat a happy vlog or content because uh, slowly there is uh, a recent news in the in my country today uh, in, the Philippines, in the Philippines wherein the Food and Drug Administration has just approved the application of a certain laboratory I think it's Lloyd Pharmaceuticals or Lloyd Laboratories their application for the uh, what you call this uh, product registration uh, submission of the CPR I guess that's a CPR certification for product registration uh, of ivermectin as a human uh, for human consumption of uh, as anti health antelmentics or antiparasitic drug okay it's not for covid yet it's as a human grade antiparasitic drug I, I i just don't know if it's 12 milligrams or 15 milligrams okay but uh the, the news, uh, in the news, it was said that Food and Drug Administration just recently approved the uh, certification of product registration of ivermectin as an anti-parasitic drug in human grade. Okay? So, now what, what, what? good does it bring to all of us uh, especially here to uh, to Filipinos uh, nationwide well uh, it was said uh, the undersecretary had made mention that of course because of this there is now a CPR of the product it means aside from as anti-parasitic drug for human use it can now be prescribed by doctors themselves for an off-label use likewise uh, especially for covid as compassion uh, as, as a comp for compassionate use okay so which means um the, the doctor who would prescribe that for their patients shall also do their obligation of monitoring the patient if there is an improvement, improvement uh, of the patient uh, with, uh, with his conditions uh, after giving the ivermectin as off-label uh, use no so he would monitor evaluate and submit the result to the food drug administ food and drug administration still so they will be closely monitored now another question is does this mean that that ivermectin will now be available everywhere in every drug stores or pharmacies everywhere the undersecretary of FDA Philippines FDA said no there will still be a uh, specific uh, drug stores that who applied I think for a uh, compassionate special permit who will uh, who can sell this and uh, but the manufacturer I think is uh, who's, who, who applied for this is Lloyd 
laboratories. That is a local pharmaceutical uh, company. So, uh, at least there's a good news. So the, I love I I love this news. There's a good news because I I, I think they cannot avoid now to accept uh, ivermectin and and uh, it's they're, they're, I think they're already contemplating that there really is a, a science now uh, with uh, ivermectin although it's available in outside the Philippines in, in other clinical trials outside the, the Philippines yet but again another good news is that uh, as per instruction of our president, President Rodrigo Duterte, he instructed the Department of Science and Technology to conduct already, very soon, the clinical trials for ivermectin with against uh, COVID-19. Okay, so those are the latest from our country and about ivermectin. So we're 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 having progress uh, at least so i love the news i love the news okay so that's it for now it's just uh as the uh, an uh, an update with regards to fda's approval of the cpr certificate of product registration applied by lloyd laboratories of local pharmaceutical company with ivermectin as human grade as antiparasitic drug which the FDA would allow an off-label use by the doctors for their patients with COVID so do you understand that? we're getting better we're getting better okay so that's it for now uh, again this is uh, Richard Solomon of my YouTube channel, Cha and My Narratives, The Stroke Survivor. Please subscribe, like, and share so that uh, they, you will be informing mean them, uh, your rel you will be informing your relatives and your families too of the good news here in the Philippines if you're Filipinos back home. So, and to to all our subscribers and uh, viewers around the world, wherever you are, something is happening good here in the Philippines. Okay, with that, thank you very much. Good night. Bye-bye.